It's a thankless job. I've been working in housekeeping for 25 years in June. Um, so what I have done in housekeeping is I started as a housekeeper and um, over the years I have worked up to a supervisory position. So my team is roughly 16 um, ladies and gentlemen that work for me in university. This year COVID has uh, given us um, a whole new set of challenges where uh, we are doing a, a lot more disinfecting of high-touch high areas um, and our cleaning, when we clean bathrooms, we don't allow anybody into the bathrooms while we're cleaning uh, so that the housekeepers can remove their masks. I anticipate some of the same things to still be in um, in, in place, like mask wearing, I assume will still be in place. Uh, we will still be cleaning uh, high touch areas and doing our deep cleaning as we have been doing this year. We're gonna continue with that as well. What I really miss um, are the interactions with the students that live here and the staff, um, because everything is either Zoom or you know, online and the uh, students are staying in their rooms more than they used to. So the best way they can support us is to continue to take out their trash, uh, which is so helpful. Be respectful of when a housekeeper asks them to use another bathroom. Uh, it's not that we're trying to be mean or to try to inconvenience our residents. We just want to make the bathroom as clean as possible for them to use safely. The way the students have shown their appreciation to our staff is that they, um, last fall, they made uh, homemade thank you notes and cards and they plastered all the custodial closet doors with them. They put them in lounges, um, just everywhere there were thank you notes for all the housekeepers, just saying thank you. And that was awesome. At any time, it doesn't have to be COVID, any time is is the right time to thank, thank your housekeeper. 